Hey everyone, welcome to Mail Time. I have watched um, just a little bit about this game and it looks so cute. So I wanted to try it. So welcome to Mail Time. <gasps> Custom characterization. Yes. Um, let's see. Hair color. Purple. 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 Outfit color. What color is that? I'm trying to see where it's changing that. I don't see it changing. Do you guys see it changing? Oh, there we go. Yes. Backpack color. Um, oh, it's already an acorn. Okay, we can have this, this, this. This may take a while. <laughs> or this. Ah, oh, this is kind of cute right here. I kind of like that. Backpack color, yes. Purple. Oh, that's adorable. Glider? We get a glider. Um, let's look and see what that looks like. Does it show us? Oh. <sighs> I don't think it shows us what that looks like. Oh my gosh. My cursor's going everywhere. Let's try that again. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's a man. It's an envelope. That's cute. Another envelope. Mail. Oh, I think that one's cute. Okay, I think I like that one. So, what is this up here? Oh, it's a hat? Doesn't let us change it. But that's hairstyle. Well, how do we change that? Can we not? Oh, is this the whole thing is hairstyle? Okay, so it's hard to see because she keeps moving. I kind of like the big towels. Oh, that sticks out like that, though. I don't know. Do I want it to stick out like that or? like that. Um, quit moving. <laughs> so they're kind of short there and then here they're kind of long. I think we're going to do long. I think we're going to do long. Okay. How, oh, you can stop it. <clears throat> oh, that's cute. Your name. Um, Riley. Okay, here we go, you guys. Well, that didn't take as long as I thought it might. You know how I am. Are we there yet? Oh my God, and it shows your character. <clears throat> no. <laughs> She's anxious. How about now? No. What about... Stop! Will you shut up if I tell you where we're going? Promise. All right. Now don't get too excited. But today's your first solo delivery. What? Yes. My ears. Oh, sorry. Right, so. <clears throat> oh my gosh, this is too cute already, you guys. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so you've got it right. You've got it, right? I think there's supposed to be a comma there. Okay, so you've got it, right? Yeah. Wait. No. One more time. Listen closely this time, then. You, you, Riley. <laughs> Me, Riley. Need to deliver that letter in your backpack to a someone named Greg. Deliver letter to Greg. 
since it's your first day on the job. First but not least, right, yes. You probably know a bit about what it's like to be a male scout. Yes, sir, Janet. I mean, ma'am. I'm talking about top of my class at Male Academy. Or, well, I'm in the top 10-ish. But I'm ready to learn. She's adorable. Well, it's one thing to learn from the books. And another thing to learn in real life. Male Scout Official Handbook, page 12. Good one, Janet. Try me on another one. Scout, what did we say about the interrupting thing? Not to do it? Yes, please try. Before you're ready to deliver your letter to Greg, we should do a practice run. See that turtle over there? Oh, look at the little cute emblem there. <clears throat> I want you to give them this note from me. You might just get something special for it. In case you forgot how your legs work. You can use L to walk around. Aye, aye, Captain Jan. Be right back. Okay, so there's a turtle somewhere. Oh. Hi. Hi, are you here for an autograph? Oh. Uh, do I have to get mail signed before I can deliver it? I don't remember that from the handbook. Oh, no. I meant, do you want my autograph because I'm famous? Oh, what for? I'm a track star in training for my next race. Speedy Shelby, they call me. Oh my God, he's adorable. Your name is Shelby? Then this letter's for you. Oh, fan mail? Of sorts? Let's see it then. This is a fake letter. Just pretend that you're reading it. It's their first delivery. Oh, I see. Is that your supervisor over there? That's Janet. She's my boss. Or something like that. I'm not really sure. <laughs> it's so cute. In that case, I accept this letter. It was delivered to me following mail scout protocol. I'm ecstatic with the service I have received. Five stars. No way. Four and a half stars. Why four and a half? You didn't want my autograph. Oops, sorry. By the by, do you happen to know where Greg is? Not currently. My brain is on sport mode. Sport mode. <clears throat> Information irrelevant to exercise can't be accessed right now. Maybe Egbert knows. He's clever. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Squirrel man, can't miss him. Asking around is the best way to find people around here. Thanks for the tip. Bye, Shelby. Peace out, little scout. Oh my God, he's adorable. So I wonder how it tells you. I'm trying to see if there's options. Oh, here we go. Letter from Shelby. Why? Oh, that didn't help. Oh, she's sitting down. That's so cute. Completing your first assigned delivery. One letter's to Greg. Okay, that's just graphics and stuff. No, I don't want to see the quick game. No, I don't want to do that. Okay, but that's where you do that. Okay, and then we can close. Okay, just checking out the... Uh, so where did she go? She's right here. She, Chief Janet, I'm back. Visibly. <laughs> and I heard you gave the letter to Shelby. Huh, how did you hear that? Wasn't easy to miss. Good job, Scout. That means you've earned your first patch. We have a patch with Love Mail Scout stamped and signed patch. Nice. She's so cute. Yippee. 
So as scouts work on a patch system, once you've done something not noteworthy, you earn a patch for it. With every patch, you get a real, you get a little bit closer to being a real mail scout, and you get a little bit better at mail delivery. For example, you might have noticed that you can jump by pressing A. No, I did not know that. Well, by holding A, you can glide as well. Oh, gasp! That's amazing. I'm literally never going to touch the ground ever again. Well, sure, why not dream big? <laughs> I like Janet. Anyways, when you deliver that letter to Greg, you'll get your official mail scout patch. You'll be a full mail scout for real. Oh, I can't wait. Good luck, Riley. I'll be here if you need me. Thanks, Mom. I mean, Mrs. Mail. I mean, Janet. Bye. Oh, don't forget, you can press Y to check your deliveries and patches in your handbook. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. One last thing. What? Where is Greg again? Does it say on the envelope? No. Then how would I know? <laughs> Go ask around and figure it out, kid. Cool, cool, cool. I can do that. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. You guys, it's so cute. Well, I guess it's time to explore. I want to see. There's jumping. If you hold it, you glide. Oh my gosh. It's too cute. Where do I want to go? Oh. I can't get up there. I tried. Can you pick up stuff along the way? No. I mean, not from there, anyway. This is adorable. You guys, the graphic style is so cute. It's just so cute. What is this, a rope? Can I glide over there? Oh my gosh, I can. Snowdrop. Oh my gosh. So cute. Whoa. Oh, hello. What's going on? You have to whisper. I'm afraid mom will find out what happened. Your mom? Yeah, her name's Daisy. She's not close by. Even with big ears, she won't be able to hear you. Okay, if you say so. Well, I have a bit of a problem. I love the stars. They make me feel so excited. Did you know that stars are really far away? But with a telescope, you can see them as if they're really close. Isn't that cool? For sure, it's like you're right next to the stars. But that doesn't sound like a problem, really. While I was looking through the telescope at the stars, there was a meteor I was trying to see. Oh, meteors are like stars that are flying. Did you know that? No, that's so cool. As I was trying to find the meteor, I was swinging the telescope around a bit. Turns out I was swinging it a bit too much. Before I knew the telescope was broken, oh no, and now the stars are far away again. Can you help me fix it? Not a problem. It looks like the lens is broken. It's the big bit of thick glass inside the telescope. Oh, I know that part, what part you mean. So the lens from a pair of glasses would work. That could work great. Okay, well I did see some around, but I don't really remember where. That's not helpful. It was either near Kiki or Donna. Don't worry, Snowdrop, I'll figure it out. Thanks, Riley. And please don't tell mom. Wouldn't dream of it. Okay, so we have to find those peoples. Um, This is adorable. Can I go up here? Oh my gosh, I can. You guys, look at the graph. Look at the top. It's a little ladybug on top of their house. Okay, so we gotta find Kiki or... Uh, I forgot who the other person was. And we're back at the beginning. I didn't mean to fly down there. Okay, well, we'll just go back up. <laughs> um, let's check our book. I 
Like, I don't see our quest. Am I just... Oh, it's RB and LB. Hold on. Oh, no, that is RB and LB. Mail scout. Oh, here we go. How do I... Oh. It doesn't really say how to open... That. How do you open that? It doesn't really tell you how to open it. Hmm. Okay, well, yeah, I don't understand how to open that, but we'll just keep going for now. Can I get any of these things? No. I don't know if there's any really like kind of forging in the game or anything yet. Can I get up on these mushrooms? Oh my gosh, that's so cute. You could just bounce on top of these. Oh. <clears throat> Kiki, okay, there's Kiki, Mel Scout. Come here. I need you to send a letter for me. Oh, what you sending? A cease and desist. To a child that crossed me. That seems a bit overkill. I'll have you know, this child robbed me in broad daylight. I was walking with my coin collection. The bag was open. I was letting the coins breathe the fresh air. Then I was interrupted by the vermin child. I think the name was Cedar. She saw the glinting of light and was fascinated by my coins. But I only had so long to walk before I had to get back to my business. The landlord business, you see. Truly time consuming. Anyway, I must say seeing a young fellow coin enthusiast, it was nice. It's not a popular hobby around here. I generously offered that Cedar, Cedar admire my coins for one hour only <clears throat> and bring them back immediately. Well, Scout. It's been 61 minutes and my paws are empty. Now I must resort to stronger measures. Or else this child will walk all over me. Nobody messes with Kiki. Do you think this is disproportionate? Cedar is only a minute late. If you were paid to ask questions, wouldn't you be called a question scout? Well, I mean... Oh, but you aren't a question scout. You're a male scout. And I have mail for Cedar. So why don't you run along and deliver it? Fine. Glad we agree. Oh my gosh, another one. Now we gotta find Cedar. Look at the little apple. You guys, look at the graphics. It's such a cute art style. I absolutely love it. And my character is adorable. She's adorable. Which way should we go? We don't even know. There's just a block here. It's like a... Who are you? Cedar? Yes. Oh, I mean, depends. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Riley, the male scout. In training. What was that last part? Nothing, nothing. Unfortunately, I have a not so nice letter for you from Kiki. Oh, crumbs. Kiki's going to make a lucky rabbit's foot charm out of me. I just know it. Why? If you could give him his coin collection back, I'm sure this will all blow over. <clears throat> That's just a thing. I lost all the coins. I'm beginning to see the problem. I met Kiki while he was walking by here. As soon as I got my paws on the collection, I hopped off searching for a great spot to admire them, but I didn't realize the bag was still open. Now all the coins are lost and I have no clue where they are. Please, can you help me? I'm afraid of what Kiki will do if I show up without them. Fret, lot, fret not, little bun. <laughs> I'll get you those coins back. Oh, thank you so much. There were four coins in the collection. Please come back when you found them all. Well, now we have to find coins. What is this right here? We found a log. Oh, so it's just kind of floating. Can we go inside here? No. Um, This is so cute. Okay. So we got to find coins. Look at all the, what is that coin? No, they're like very large 
Iris, maybe? Irises, maybe? We gotta find coins. We gotta find. Okay, who's this? Haley, hello! What are you doing out here? Just delivering some mail. Sounds fun. What are you doing? I'm watching over my turnips. Oh, they're cute. I'm hoping to win this year's Harvest Festival in the smallest turnip category. <laughs> oh, these are tiny. Thanks. That's it. Oh, icebreaker patch. Woohoo! All right. <clears throat> All right, coins. If I were coins, where would I be? I have no idea. Look, I don't know. Look at all these apples and mushrooms. Okay, that now we're back to cedar. So let's go, um, I don't know. Let's go through this way and see. I wonder if they could be anywhere high up. <clears throat> oh my gosh, look at all the sunflowers. That is so cute. Oh. I found a coin. Yay me! We got one! Okay, we just gotta find three more coins. Y'all, this may take a while. I wonder if you could kind of see them from up here at all. Wow, look how to... Oh, there's one up there. No, get up. Oh, how do we get up there? Oh my goodness. Hi. Irene, what do you want? I'm a little busy right now. Come back later. Well, okay then. Oh, there's, look at the bee. Oh, that's me. Oh, I don't think that was a coin coin. Wow, look how high we are. Look how high we are. Oh my gosh, you guys. Yeah, this may take a hot minute to find. I like how she just sits down when you're not doing anything. <clears throat> you don't really get to fly too high. Um, <clears throat> oh, this is such a clever setup. Look at this, honey. I see a coin right there. Oh, I want to go down right there. Yeah, I see a coin right there. Oh, I wonder if we can jump down like this. Perfect. Okay, we got another coin. So, I wonder if it tells how many coins we... Oh. Collectible, collectible earth coin. Applewood. This bronze cone has a hole in it. That's so cool. I don't know if these... That's a flower coin. <clears throat> oh, no. Don't do that. Um. Okay, so earth coin, flower coin, tool coin, towel coin, click mushroom coin. Okay. So we found another coin. Um, what's that up there? Oi. Oh no, I am not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. Gonna make it. We did not make it. <clears throat> Yeah, you don't get to fly for too, very high or for very long. So that's something to keep in mind. Can I make it up there? No. Uh, okay, we're going to have to start over and get up higher. Whoa, I'm stuck. Oh, I found a lens. I found a lens for the, um, the other thingy. Oh my gosh, there's a snail. Donna, hello. What are you doing here? Hi. I'm delivering meal. Oh, that sounds like fun. Oh, my name is Donna. What's your name? Riley. It's good to meet you, Riley. What do you have to, Scout? I'm working on this big delivery. 
For someone named Greg, do you know him? Oh, no, sorry. I'm pretty new to the area. No worries, thanks anyway. Okay, so we need to get back to the one area we were at. I love how the bee follows her. That's so cute. I feel like I'm lost in sunflowers. <laughs> you don't see how to get any higher here. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I think we need to try to get out of this area so we can get back up higher. <clears throat> Here we go. And there's somebody down there too. Where did I see that one coin? We'll just go back up again, maybe. Okay, so we're kind of up here again. I'm trying to remember where I saw that one coin now. Mm. Oh, it's up there on that limb. Gosh, I wonder how we're supposed to get up that high. supposed to get up that high. That's really high. It's kind of like we need to get over there somehow. Oh, we need to go up and around over there. Hmm. I think we need to go. Oh my gosh, you can get on top of the sunflowers. Get up there. We need to get up on these mushrooms, I think. There. Get up there. Okay. Um, maybe we can get up this high. Um, now I'm lost where I'm at. <laughs> places like this and we need to get not sure where we need to get um, I feel like we just need to get up oh no oh my gosh you guys this is going to take a hot minute to figure out <laughs> um can you get up there There's a bear over there, though. Oh my gosh, Jump, jumping around on the mushrooms is hard. Um, no, yeah, it's a little tough to figure out right off the bat. we need to go if we can go over here somehow 
Oh, takeoff patch. Nice. Um, like, I kind of want to go see if we can get over there. I don't think we can fly that far. No, we cannot. Is there anything? Oh, maybe. I wonder if it echoes. Excuse me? Echo! Echo, echo, echo! Echo, echo, echo! <laughs> you shouldn't be here. What? Oh my gosh, who's talking? Like, I don't even know. Oh, it's like a person over here. Hiya! Ribbit! Oh my god, it's a frog. Are you a froggy? You can talk, right? Ribbit is talking. Oops, I mean Ribbit. Who are you? Name's irrelevant. Think of me as he who controls the worms. <laughs> Ribbit. Do you want to hear a secret? Uh, okay, funny well voice. Tell me your very legitimate, totally real secret. Did you know? Socks in tennis aren't real. Oh my gosh, it, it's a replica glued onto their head. Oh my gosh, their real one fell off in a skiing accident. That's some niche knowledge. How did you know that? The worms whispered their secrets to me. Okay, ribbit. Cool. Tell the worms I said hi. Will do. Nice. Okay, well, bye-bye, voice. Ribbit. Okay, that was cute. Okay, so um, the key is way up there. Jeez, how are we supposed to get up there? I really wanted to get on top of the roof, but I don't know how to do that yet. Um, can I get anywhere from here? Oh, there's something going on over there. Oh, it's the waterfall. Okay, I got it. Um... Look at the little ladybug. They're like everywhere. Well, we may end here, you guys. This is just the start of hopefully another little series we'll do. Um, I think it's adorable. You guys, let me know what you think in the comments. But I think it is so cute. I love the concept of it. I love the... <laughs> I love the graphic style so much. And the animals are adorable. And I th just think it's a, it's a wonderful, cozy game. Let me know what you think about it in the comment. Hit like on the video. Show it some loving. Till next time, I'll see you soon.